step in from the back. Like what can I step on? Can I step on it? Yep. Ooh. Oh! Great. Do I look like a farmer? Nope. I guess there's no key. Oh, is there not? Are you having fun? It's Sunday. We are on our way to do a little bit of a grocery haul. Um, I'm going to get some ingredients to make a bunch of stuff in our crock pot. Um, which I think I'm going to make like a whole video on that because I feel like whenever I um, share stuff from recipes that I make in the crock pot, people always ask me, so I might as well make a video about it. Mac slept pretty poorly last night because he has a runny nose and it's just that time of year. It begins the season of the runny nose. So I'm trying to do activities indoors with him and I count grocery shopping as an activity, especially at one of our local grocery stores. And he gets to get a cake pop. Right, Mac, do you get a cake pop? Here we go, off to the races. You want a cake pop? Can you say good? <laughs> what color is it? <laughs> Pink. Thank you. Okay, I'm about to head back home. I just wanna say that it's all right, dude, we're leaving soon. He wants to get going, he hates sitting in a still car. But I need to get this off my chest. There was a woman helping bag groceries at the store and she was very sweet and she meant so well, but like several times stuck her hands in Mac's face. Like he was done with his cake pop and she took his stick from him, which again, meant well, was trying to prevent him probably from choking, but after she took his stick, was, you know, started tickling him, and he kind of whined about it, and you would think like when a kid whines when they're touched, that would be like the signal to stop doing something, but um, she kind of just kept going, and I felt rude, but I said, you know, he doesn't really like it when people he doesn't know gets in his face, so, you know, maybe don't touch him. So a few minutes go by, she's continuing to bag groceries, and she just looked at him, and again, really sweet, really nice, just said, oh, he's so cute, and goes and like, messes his hair, and rustles it, and he starts crying. Again, this is a kid who like, had kind of a rough morning with a runny nose, and finally was happy, and he just didn't like this. And he sneezed, and she, he had a runny nose, and so I went and got, a napkin that I had in my cart from Starbucks and she whipped one out of her <sighs> pocket somewhere, I don't know, and said, here, let me help. And again, just so helpful, so sweet, but like he was already upset and I don't know, it's just like my PSA of like, if it's not your kid, maybe don't touch them. He's happy now, but you know, did take a little bit of calming down before we got back to this point. So I'm gonna go home, and um, even though I did a bunch of grocery shopping today, I think we're gonna get pizza tonight. Um, but at least we're prepped for the week. Check on the tractor progress with Rob. There's something in the air And a sparkly shimmer on our skin That went surprisingly well. He has not been good at putting his coat on lately, so. Good job, Mac. probably die, dude. Please don't do it. Please don't do it or don't die. Don't, both? <laughs> you, oh, you have brakes. Yeah. Goodbye. Okay,
gosh. Oh, no control, he's safe. Don't go into the tree, please. He hasn't gotten it to start yet, and so. Oh, is that the new exhaust pipe? I'm dead. Is that the new exhaust pipe? I kind of want to see what it looks like from the top of the hill. Yeah. He thinks that's funny. You think that's funny? Wait, buddy. You're getting help. You want it? Tractor. Tractor. You want to climb on it now? It reeks of gas. So what's the next step? Oh, look at him, he's helping. <laughs> Let me go see what it looks like from up above. I don't know how he's... Some say you can't start the Christmas season until Thanksgiving is over. Some start right after Halloween. I know that the Christmas season is officially here when these bad boys hit the grocery store shelves. So, pumpkin beer, my beloved pumpkin beer is gone. And we've got, oh, we've got a few more in the fridge there. And winter warmer is in the fridge. And this is how the cat gets to enjoy her weekend. Go ahead, Peanut. I got this box just for you. Go ahead, check it out. Go ahead, go check it out. Of course, a few seconds after I stop rolling, she decides to climb in here. It's a good one, right? It's your favorite kind. There she is, in the woods. Rob put a spotlight on it for tonight. I think we're gonna get like some kind of solar light for it, and I'm not sure if this is where we're gonna keep it, but <laughs> here we go. All right, so I just sat down to upload all the video that I took over the weekend, and I realized I hadn't closed out the video yet, so I'm going to do that right here, right now. Thanks for watching our weekend vlog. We'll keep you posted on the tractor and um, what we end up doing with it. I think we're gonna end up doing a Christmas photo shoot for our holiday cards this year. So, um, I don't know, maybe I'll vlog that or share that somewhere. Um, but thank you all for watching. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, share it, and I'll see you in the next one.